Hey guys, and welcome back to Mother's Barbecue. On this video, we're gonna be doing a Michigan favorite. We're gonna be doing an olive burger. So stick around. All right, so the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna get our olive topping done. So what I got here is some green olives that I pitted. You can buy these unpitted, but me being a bonehead, bought the ones with the pits in them. I'm gonna do about half of a lime, uh, sorry, half of a lemon zest, some minced garlic, we've got some capers, some green parsley, and some olive oil. And that's it. We'll go ahead and get this uh, blended so it's nice and smooth. And we'll get this into a bowl. All right, so we got our olive topping done. Uh, the one thing I didn't show was putting a little salt and pepper to taste into that. You don't need a lot because those capers are a bit salty. We're gonna get this in the fridge and let it, let it set up. Let's get our burgers going. All right, so we're gonna be using our Mojo griddle on our kettle here. I'm gonna add a little bit of olive oil. Spread that around. I have some really nice ground chuck. I'm gonna hit it with a little salt and, pe salt and pepper mixture. We'll get these on. Got some provolone cheese here. And we got some brioche buns. We're gonna get toasted up here. All right, our patties are ready. Let's go ahead and get these off. All right, let's complete this uh, olive burger. I mean, this is extremely simple. I don't, I, I don't know how much simpler this thing can get. We got some nice brioche buns that are toasted. We got our burger with our provolone cheese right there. And then we're gonna take some of our olive mixture and we're just gonna to top it with it. And that's it. We'll get our top bun on. From what I know, this is Michigan's, one of Michigan's uh, favorite style burgers, the olive burger. If you guys know anything different, please comment below. Let me know what you're thinking. Let's go ahead and bite into this. All right, let's give this a try. It's definitely got a unique flavor. It's very salty, um, very herby. The olives remind me of a tapenade like you'd find on a bruschetta or something. Uh, it's really good. It's definitely unique. Give me a comment down below if you guys have had this before and really like it. You guys give that a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you guys on the next run. Thanks for watching.